and fun to watch on the internet, and we're so glad you do, because you know that's kind of yes, what we all do. Yes, thank you for watching uh, yeah, all the you. stuff we do on the internet. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> please please keep watching, watch more of it. Also, this sounds crazy. <laughs> when you are here in this room, you are a part of it. So yeah. thank you for being a part of it for this one time, never gonna happen again. No one can be in the room when we do this again. So again, thanks to you. <laughs> wow. uh, gosh. All right, I guess we should introduce ourselves and then we're gonna tell you about uh, the swag you got, and then we're, we're gonna play a spooky Call of Cthulhu horror RPG game where they might die, they might die, they might die. Might? They will die. <laughs> no, me. I'm not going to. Look, I killed one person once, I think. No. Yeah. That has nothing to do with RPGs. And yeah. <laughs> Which is it? We can keep a secret. Yeah. <laughs> and this room and that Twitch can all keep a secret. And the all of us. that you've directly addressed already. <laughs> yeah. This, I'm going to send this in a time capsule to space. Anyway, separate story. Uh, my name is Becca Scott, and... Uh, And if you're here, you're already almost at all the things I want to tell you about, uh, except that um, make sure you check out the show Abria is running on Saturday. Yeah. Dimension 20. <laughs> this is the Magic Live. And that's all about me. Uh, Sage, tell us you. Oh, hi. Hello. Uh, are we introducing ourselves or just our characters as well? Don't introduce your characters, no whatever characters. you do. Just you. Oh, I'm telling you anything. Good question. <laughs> <laughs> that's a good cue. Hi, I'm Sage Ryan. I go by Not Sage everywhere on the internet or Pixel Circus. Uh, and I'll be at some other things this weekend, so I hope I will get to see a lot of your faces there. Hi, Bria. How's it going? Hi, I'm everybody. Sweet. I'm Bria Iyengar. Uh, Yay! Yay! And uh, yeah, you can see me on Saturday playing a little Misfits in Magic <laughs> with the bad kids of Gal Penny, uh, of which Becca Scott will be one of them. So check that out on Saturday. Oh, oh <laughs> hi. Uh, my name's Paula Deming. I am. Um, hi. Sketch comedy called Woo! Things Get Dicey. You can find it on YouTube and uh, uh, yeah, I, I'll be around all weekend. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, I'm Josephine McAdam. You can, Ow! Ow! Woo! You can find me at JCVIM on Twitch, on Twitter, on whatever social media exists, um, and in some movies sometimes. And I'll be Ooh. around this weekend, so I hope to see you at some other events. All right. Uh, and also, I want to give the hugest, hugest thank you to Chaosium, the publishers of Call of Cthulhu that have kindly and graciously chosen to not only sponsor this show, but for Brian and Mob to be here and be the most wonderful people that they are right in the back. They, they helped you come into the doors and have gifted you a game. <gasps> Miskatonic <gasps> Repository for you and you and you and you and you. Sorry, that's another reason why they are slightly cooler than you people at home. I'm so sorry. You have to <laughs> stop so telling sorry. the future people yeah. that they're bad. I didn't yeah. tell them they're bad. I said there's someone cooler. <laughs> if, tomato, tomato. You know what? If someone was like, Becca, you're really cool, but there is someone cooler, a Bria Young guy, I'd be like, yeah, I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> that's objectively untrue. Anyway. We can talk about this all day, but I'm going to start a horror game now. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I need so. to finish posting on Instagram. Great. I don't <laughs> want to be rude. I'm paying attention. I'm I, I, I am on my phone. Everyone, please go like Paula's Instagram post later. Um, please post. Yes. Okay. Uh, this. It's this just is a live, live show. I was going to do more ha Paula. hashtags, but. <laughs> this is a live show, and I have chosen these four people specifically because they are all chaos incarnate, and that <laughs> makes me happy. Um, and I, I hope you two will feel empowered to be chaos incarnate in this room. If it's a horror game, and as such, there will be certain times where things will get horny. <laughs> <laughs> the sentence ended different than I thought it would. Yeah, me too. Me too. I don't understand what you mean. Uh, if you think something could be hornier and it's not, um, if you could just snap. 
I feel like that would be good. We'll get the signal. Oh, oh they can just demand horny. Can we do it too? Hold on. <laughs> Nothing. You may. You may. Everyone is entitled like to snaps. Anyway, we've already <laughs> six minutes in, and I think we're off to a really good start. Are you in, what? Carrie? What are you? They demanded. They snapped. They snapped. <laughs> It's a role-playing game. You could just describe the thing you do. I hug a Bria. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna need you to Perfect. roll for that though on uh, like hug. Nailed Shit. it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. A few things. Uh, it's about to get creepy up in here for real. I will not make horny jokes for at least two minutes. And uh, let's start by uh, explaining the briefest of the game system. This is Call of Cthulhu. You are rolling percentile dice. Everybody has a whole bunch of skills on their sheet, and they're all percentages, and you want to roll low, because if your skill is a high number, then there's more things you could roll under. That's it. That's it. That's Call of Cthulhu. Done. Love it. Okay. <laughs> Nailed it. Basically, yeah. The year is 1890. You are. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Uh, we have some people who are crewmen, crew, crewmen, meaning persons, crew Thank people you. aboard a vessel, <laughs> the Antigua Nautica, a clipper sailing from the Caribbean through the Suez Canal to the East Indies, or at least that's the plan. It is helmed by Captain Alia Hornswallow. <laughs> it's the that's a normal name. <laughs> it can't be hornier. You it can't. Pros. Pros. She yes. <laughs> a buxom. Please describe her for me. Uh, yes. Go on. <laughs> yes. A, a buxom lady uh, who is the captain of our of our vessel here, mm -hmm. but but in a way that like just to make it a little hornier, like it's very uh -huh. buttoned up though, you know. Okay. So it leaves oh. a lot to the imagination, which we all know is actually hornier than just seeing everything. At least in my imagination, it is. Um, <laughs> she's got a really cool captain's hat, you know, like a tri-cornered captain's hat, and uh, she carries a saber. Amazing. I'm in love. Someone tell me her hair, eye color, skin color. Okay, she's from the Caribbean. Oh, <laughs> brown <laughs> skin. She has like a uh, deep brown, luscious waves, and as oftentimes when no one else is around, she'll just go to the fore of the ship and just stand there like a mass with her, mast with her hair <laughs> streaming in the wind. She'll pull out her saber, put it back away. Practice pulling it out real fast. <clears throat> this is a horror game. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, uh, the two of you, Rowena and Mabel, ghost hunters, lore seekers as you may be, have just disembarked from the small wooden dinghy <laughs> That transported you from the port dock to this vessel. <laughs> uh, the crewman helped you to climb aboard the ladder amidst your skirts or canes. Who knows? We'll find out soon. You turned to wave farewell at the dockman that delivered you, but he's disappeared all too quickly on such a clear night as this. The stars are above you as you board the creaky wooden ship. What are you wearing as you climb the ladder, Rowena? Oh my goodness. <clears throat> Rowena is, uh, she's giving very crisp, white, like, blousey shirt. Uh, she's got like a tweed skirt um, that is uh, long and full. But you see as she's kind of climbing up the side of the ship, it splits open and she's got riding pants <gasps> underneath. Yes. Just like a yes. stealth. Thank you. Just a stealth <laughs> riding pant, uh, mm. knee-high boots, uh, brown leather gloves. She's very well put together. And her hair is pulled back uh, on a, it would look severe if she wasn't, well, no, we're, we're old for the time. <laughs> Yeah, I made you super old yeah. because you asked me yeah. to. Yeah. I'm yeah. 35, yeah. so it's yeah. severe. <laughs> the life as expectancy I, was not. As I ride in towards senility. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> At least your riding score is high. And Yes, it is. Uh, oh. who, who accompanies you? There it is. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> I love that. Who accompanies you if you oh. as you turn to her? My, my darling friend in this life, just a roommate, a confidant. <laughs> History will remember us as the best of friends. 
With a hand on her shoulder, I lift up the corner of a many layer tufted skirt uh, that you can see a practical shoe underneath. Uh, throughout it, it's very like tightly corseted uh, at her waist and it's deep shades of magenta with um, a, like nice off white down the center. Um, her hair is short and a deep shade of like an auburn red that has like some waves down the side of it, very like gelled down and coiffed. Um, as she like brushes one stray hair out of the way, uh, excited by the sight of something that seems a little odd. It's a little spooky, wasn't it? It was. It was. He's was just gone. He was a ghost. <laughs> <laughs> a sea ghost. I hope there's more. <laughs> well, that's certainly what we're paying for. <laughs> That's right. These two have paid their boarding for the ship's passage. And uh, the sky is dark, but for these stars, dimmed periodically by the clouds passing overhead, you are just a couple up for adventure. You can tell us oh, why. Not a couple. Uh, no, just friends. <laughs> Please. Oh, ghost hunting associates. Thank you so much. Widows. Oh, terror. And I miss, I want to say, Henry? Terrible. Henry. Oh, terrible. Terrible. You're, it's not a couple, I've got it. Yes, ah, hey, I be Jack Martin. Jack Iron Eye Martin. Amazing. I just gently try to touch his elbow to see if I can pass through. Oh, that's me. <laughs> ah, I be not a ghost, nay, but as the steward of the ship, I will be your primary lead in guiding you through the haunts aboard uh, across the Atlantic for, yes, uh, well, it may be new that we sponsor such ghost tourism. <laughs> you are our first two passengers aboard Look at such that. a ship. Uh, but we have been a cargo ship for quite some time and needed an uh, alternate source of income, and so this is something we're trying out. I Dark believe detail. saying the quiet part out loud. Yeah, you don't have to say that part. <laughs> no. Got it, we won't say it again. <laughs> so, hmm. turn and look out at the dark sea. Do you see the spot of light? No, they, they're not being one there now, but oh. ghost lights, they're called. Sometimes they be out there, so keep an eye peeled. I'll keep just the one eye, because the other one's the iron eye, hence the nickname. <laughs> <laughs> but when there's hardly a wave like this, that's when you'll see. A ghost ah! lantern! Sorry, what? And he pulls out, it, uh, it's like sticks and yarn sewn to look like a, a hand uh, holding a lantern. <laughs> the, jump, the jump was the... Uh, yeah. yeah. Well, thank, thank you. you. That uh, I worked for months. You did? Months. Finding the yarn that was the right color. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, delightful. Loved it. Loved being skipped. So good. Continue, you're doing great. <laughs> I'll show you to your quarters. Follow me. And he walks with a limp and then oh. pulls out some, a flask from his jacket and takes a little You should absolutely nip. keep passing that. Oh, well, it's, uh, I don't know. Ooh. There's no protocol. You're the first uh, ghost right. passenger. Yes, uh, yes. uh, and as this is happening, far <laughs> above. <laughs> So good, you're good. Far above, uh, we, we scan past the mizzen mast to the crow's nest on the main mast where we find a little birdie. <laughs> He's like, Chris, did you want me to take over? Or were you nope. like, uh, find uh, me. Just forgot your name for a sec. Clara Birdie Bird. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Some people call me Birdie because I spend a lot of time up in the rigging and also my last name Bird. I thought it was hyphenated. Clara oh. Birdie Bird. Birdie Bird. I can see how that, you know, a lot of people uh, think that when I introduce myself that way. There is but, a pelican uh, that often visits you that's sitting on the edge of the crow's nest that you can tell any of this to that you should wait. And you know, when I introduce myself that way, Pelly. People think they don't understand what my name is, and then it's like too awkward to have to correct them later. I know. Oh, okay, thanks for visiting. It flew off. Yeah, Pelly uh, can you do know. that. Yeah. Tell yeah. us a little bit more about Birdie. Yeah, so Birdie is uh, a member of the crew on this ship. 
Uh, she is in kind of breeches, uh, very, you know, menswear, especially for the time, but she's working uh, of a uh, white, you know, cotton shirt, things that are uh, fairly well fitted. She needs to be able to move in them, but you can't let anything get tangled in the rigging because she's always climbing up in the sails. Well, I mean, <laughs> sometimes you can, but uh, not, not normally. Uh, you, it needs to be on purpose. Uh, anyway, so uh, a hair in a, in a tight braid, again, to keep it all close. Uh, she has a swallow tattoo on one hand, uh, marking that she has traveled 5,000 nautical miles. <laughs> Just a um, reminder, is that what you thought it was? Are we just Never clapping mind. when it's horny now, or are we snapping when it needs to be horny? I'm I gave them the power to do with which, whatever works, <laughs> <but> yeah. <laughs> um, she is 26 and uh, a, a, a smaller build, but very nimble. Uh, Quick with her hands. So that's and like middle aged, right? Yeah. Because <laughs> I'm I'm 38, so I'm Oof. on my way. I'm God. quite young no. compar comparatively. Uh, and old, yeah, though. just I've <laughs> been on a ship for a long time. Very comfortable up high. Uh, just then, you notice someone is climbing up the rigging towards you. Birdie. Oh yeah. Did you hear about the passengers? Yeah. Weird, right? Yeah. I wonder if we'll get more of them. I, I, I mean, I, I would, I would like to play tricks on them. Can we play <gasps> tricks on them? Yes, we absolutely could play tricks on them. Oh, this is Edward Webb. <laughs> <laughs> Edward Webb uh, is a crewman, new to the ship. You know, not really uh, much of a title. He does a lot of taking the buckets of, of mm -hmm. poo and having to dump them yeah. off. Um, that's his yeah, main yeah, job. Yeah, that's that's his like main a, job. that's one person's job, and that's like a full-time I'm glad job. I'm not the one who has to do it. Edward, I'm so glad you're on this ship. <laughs> But I don't have to do your job. No, 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 no. So I don't have to do your job. No, 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 no. So I don't have to do your job. Not because. Sure. Uh, now, you know. Because I was meaning to tell you, Birdie. I'm glad you're on the oh ship. Oh my gosh. Too. I have a. Uh, oh, I think I spotted something. Um, uh, oh, no, it was nothing. Just. Uh, we <laughs> pan down below this so awkward oh, conversation. <laughs> uh, down, down below the deck of the ship. Uh, and Iron Eye is leading these two uh, down into a mess hall. It's crammed with a bunch of uh, like picnic tables, low tables with picnic benches on either side, as well as it, if were there more crew, were the ship adequately prepared, there would be people sleeping in the uh, hammocks lining this room, but this is the mess hall. And as we pass through the serving hatch, we find Chef. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's uh, after main meal, yeah. and uh, there is a gruff woman named Myrna that is washing dishes beside you. She doesn't talk much. I prefer it this way. She actually had her tongue ripped out by uh, some pirates. I feel a little bad now. <laughs> <laughs> to preference. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good no. meal. It's a good meal. Oh. Good serving meal. She tries to tell you. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do this to me. <laughs> um, uh, merci. Uh, I know you are complimenting me profusely, as you always do. There's never a bad meal in my house. <laughs> uh, describe chef for us. Yeah, <clears throat> chef is a. Uh, Bulky, takes up a lot of space, covered in tattoos, very little hair. <laughs> I, I have to know more. Yeah. 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 Keep going. Like it's dark, I can't snap. <laughs> um, uh, they have um, a prosthetic limb that has their chef knife permanently <laughs> attached <laughs> to it. Interesting. Uh, swaps out for different cooking utensils, but it's usually just on the knife. What's, is that what's on it now? That's what's on it now. Yeah. Um, did I cut? Tattoos? Yeah, right? yeah. 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 What's the sexiest tattoo? 
Um, yeah, it's like a blooming rose. Ooh, Follow up question, what's the sexiest is. utensil? <laughs> the spatula. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's like, oh, yeah, the tracks. Okay. <clears throat> oh, but currently, Chef has like dark makeup around their eyes and it's kind of look like very gaunt and trying to like look a little spooky because uh, yeah. they may have heard that there are guests coming aboard. And indeed, Iron Eye sidles up to your serving hatch. Beware. Sometimes aboard these sea vessels, nay, we don't even have all living crew. We have sometimes a spooky chef. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh. It's a fresh ghost. <laughs> I have been possessed by the chef that came before me. Bumperino the second, uh, who takes over, watch out. <laughs> yeah, let me, I would love to stop you right there. The ghost thing is one, you have a knife for an arm and you could just lead with that. <laughs> it's how I cook. Wait a minute, are you telling me that my iron eye is perhaps even spookier than the yarn hand I have <laughs> I would argue your whole vibe. Yeah. Arr, you so seem very good. unsafe. Okay, so yeah. far. <laughs> May I have... <clears throat> yeah, oh, yeah. 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 Okay, okay, great. So, re re review thus great. far. Okay, great. Oh, you're doing great. Yeah, eat some food. Ooh. This is <laughs> soup. I just soup. ate. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Yes, we asked Chef to save some back. Uh, the other... <laughs> you have a spoon use, use your hands. That is how it's supposed to be consumed. Do you have a spoon? A spoon? No a spoon. spoon support this ship. No. <laughs> this is good. Can you do roll for intelligence, please? <laughs> no. Oh, no. <laughs> no. No. Cool. No. This seems it's like a great idea to have gotten on this ship. Um, nothing about it seems desperate at all. Um, <laughs> from the side of the crew. Hello. Uh, yeah. Can you also roll for constitution? And can you roll for your cooking, your culinary art skill? Let's see how good the soup is. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely not. Uh, this is, yeah, no. Well, let's hope it's good soup. <laughs> oh, well, you know. <laughs> I rolled a 44, which is under the 45 that I needed. It is edible. Uh, yes. <laughs> I've had better, I've had worse. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, you know. Was that how would you think? I've had better, I've had worse. <laughs> it was good. Oh, do I see. Do we have to do it back? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I'm uh, trying to help. Let me show you to your quarters. It's just the one quarter. In fact, it oh. was where we would keep the fish. No. Uh, the uh, fish? <laughs> well, it's a cargo ship, but sometimes, you know, after you've been out on, on the sea for quite a while, the biscuits, they get dry and the rats get to them. And so that's when you need to find other sources of protein. Never. That's be spooky, scary, right? Yeah, this is. <laughs> It'd be a bunch of fish ghosts. Yeah. Doing crazy. <laughs> Follow me and step yeah. clunk, step clunk. Yeah, he has one peg leg uh, on the yeah. right. Yeah, so he leans left. And uh, that. Have you notice our tour guide's kind of listing to the side. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> is it the same side as the eye? Or is it the opposite? Yeah, yeah what's happening? Same side, same side. Oh, okay. The right is all. Uh, He's got a lucky found side. Found parts. <laughs> <laughs> lucky side. <laughs> Uh, he shows you quarter. to your quarters. It's a small room with two hammocks in it. Uh, oh, oh, good. That's it. <laughs> Thanks. Your, uh, some crewmen bring in your trunk or trunks, depending on how much trunks? work it's just trunks. Just friends. <laughs> Thank you. You don't know, have like a cot or something? Yeah. Like a <clears throat> actual uh, bed. Uh-huh. Edward. We're old. See what we can do That's to maybe find some mats, maybe take some of the furs of the rats and stuff oh. them oh. into a sack. We can make we can make a bed a bed roll for you. Interesting. If you Thank prefer. You. The hammock I, I prefer. I think we can handle I the hammock. hammock. I think we can handle the hammock. So this is where you are sleeping. Oh, I follow. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Uh, Hi. Uh, yes. I'll leave you to get acquainted with some of the crew and it, please feel free to make your way down and meet the new Casperty. <laughs> 
Yeah. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Sh uh, chef, was it? Oui. Is that the whole name? Oui. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Have you ever seen anything terrifying on the ship, like any sort of ghost oh. and or monsters? Yes, all the time, yes. All the time. Oh. Every morning I wake up and I see my friend next to me. It's uh, Mr. Uh, Rogers, no. <laughs> yes, yes it is. It's an hey, improv God. game, it's an improv game. Yeah. Improv is valid and that doesn't mean anything yet, it's 1890. Mm -hmm. And he's terrifying. Uh, he rises up out of the sheets and he's just, he has no head. Mm. He's just a body and he's like the inflatable, <laughs> like the inflatable. Uh, Are you oh, creating an NPC wow. or what is oh. happening? <laughs> they really don't. Go on. Okay. I don't know, Becca. You say you're friend, Mr. Rogers? Yeah. Did you know this person in life? I did not, but since I've been on this ship for mm, 20 years or so, yes, since I was 15. <laughs> oh, you're oh, old. Everyone's old. Everyone's old. I'm, I'm 35, by the yeah. way. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Jeff. Uh, we oh, birdie. Oh, I, oh, we're all just birdies. Birdies. I just like calm This is where they sleep, so oh. if you need to, you know. Oh, hey, is there any uh, what? Is, yeah. is there any soup left? I missed I missed the oh, main meal. Birdie, for you, you know I always have soup. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank <laughs> you. It's on your boot person. Soup. Yeah, you don't carry Hi. soup. Hi, you're going to have to introduce yourself if you're going to drink boot soup in our uh, <laughs> fish room. <laughs> Hi, I'm Marina. Hi. Uh, Mabel. I'm Birdie. Oh, Hi, your hands I, are full. Birdie. Um, yeah, I'm. Soup. I'm mostly up in the in the nets, but I come down. The nets. Those are what's in the water. The rigging. <laughs> right. Sometimes we call them nets because you never I, know what you're gonna I catch. I believe you. <laughs> yeah. Just then you hear a yell. Birdie, you hear it first. Uh, Could have made your roll for that, didn't? <clears throat> <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Um, shh. Birdie, shh. everyone. Birdie. Birdie. Someone, Quick, quick! And you, you recognize the voice of Edward, Edward, who you had left in your nest to keep watch. Oh, 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 what do you do, do, do with the soup? Uh, the soup. Uh, Drink it up. <laughs> okay. Edward needs me, but uh, do, don't. I'm gonna give this to you. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna, gonna tell you. Wait, the real horror of this ship is what's gonna happen to you after you drink this soup. So I'm just gonna tell you that don't. If she offers you any more, oh. don't. If they offer you any more, don't have any. Why don't you oh. take it? Why could okay. you take it? Because I'm because chef uh, yeah. because chef is I have a chef with a knife, so I'm gonna drink whatever they Listen. give me. Yeah. Here. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thank chef you. and I have been on this ship together for a year. There's an emergency. Oh, There's an emergency. It's okay. <laughs> I don't. I'm gonna, as I'm going, I'm open a window. <laughs> I'm going to check on Edward, and I'm I'm thinking to myself like I don't know how I'm supposed to act with these people on this boat that are not crew. Like that was a weird exchange. It was, it was. awkward. It was. I tried to do a spooky thing, and it, they didn't seem spooked. Uh, uh, Edward, as, as as you head up, uh, you will notice everyone who was below deck has rushed past mm. your room down this hall. Everyone is going up the stairs quickly, responding to Edward's. Uh, cries for help. Yeah. He's still calling for help. Is he still up there? Yeah. Does I anyone else go? What if um, I die? What if someone's dying? <laughs> right now? Oh my god. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Chef definitely <laughs> heard that whole exchange, and I would love to do a sanity check right now. <laughs> <laughs> Just hearing the About commentary on my cooking. Oh, yes. Oh. Roll for sanity. Thank you. <clears throat> um, you get a bonus die. This is easy. <laughs> Oh, well, I passed. I okay, great, great, great. I'm good, I'm good. <clears throat> I think they are just tired, but I will uh, follow right behind their footsteps. The camera bounces Every behind step. you, handheld, so you know it's intense. Oh, we're not holding yeah. hands. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so you are roommates or what? <laughs> You know how every morning you wake up and you see Mr. Rogers, the headless ghost? It's like that. <laughs> the camera doesn't cut. It's like Dunkirk. It goes up the stairs and it pans and you're oh, seeing water. over the shoulder of our main characters here as you see the dark sky no longer has a single star. You see Edward up in the, on the, the main mast in the crow's nest. <laughs> I have a cheat sheet. But <laughs> The main mast. Uh, you see Edward sitting uh, 
in your usual yeah. spot, Birdie, and just beyond him, but high in the sky, there's a new cloud. And this cloud is a red, gaseous fog, but it is moving very quickly, although staying in one place, it's as if it's roiling in place hundreds of feet above the four, the four <laughs> of the ship. I can't look at Sage. <laughs> is it, does it look like any, does it look natural? Does it look like anything I've ever seen before? I'll, I spent a lot of time looking up at the clouds. You do nothing but, and this is unlike anything you have ever seen before, nor that any of you have ever seen before. Please roll for sanity. Oh no. Oh my sainted art. Uh oh. Ooh. I rolled two uh, one D one hundred. I rolled the wrong die, and I rolled sixty on both of them. Wait, I have to roll a one. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> they were the same. 60. Yeah, yeah they, they were. What's my sanity? I got a nineteen. I crushed it. Oh, that's pretty yeah. crushing. Yeah. Yeah, I got a sixty-one. My current sanity is fifty. Okay, so that's a fail. I'm going to need you to take three uh, sanity loss. Now, if oh, you fine. could note. One fifth of your sanity level. It is uh, next to power, that mm. smallest number, like 13, for example. If you were to lose that in a single day, you will go in, in temporarily insane. Oh, tight. Uh, tight. Yeah, this audience got a pencil. A bowl. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> roommate. Wait, sure, <laughs> my normal roommate that I care about <laughs> in normal amounts. Okay. Uh, so, uh, how much did I lose? I you lost three. 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 You're going to lose two. Okay. You're my dear. Thank you. Oh my god, it's cute pets. <laughs> this ain't D and D. We get our own rules. Thank you. Was that a pass, Jeff? Oh yes, yes. Uh, I passed yeah. like a twenty-nine out of a thirty-nine. It looks like bloody mashed potatoes to me. <laughs> I. You think that's potatoes? In the sky? <laughs> no, that's clearly some spooky red cloud, but it looks like things I've Hold seen. On. Oh. You put a little grease paint on your face. That's actually scary. I need you to temper your reaction. What is that? It, I have it, seen things that could make your blood boil. It's just, you know, a red cloud. <laughs> <laughs> nope. Oh. Uh, you're, Mabel and Birdie, as you look up in it, and you can't look away for a moment, you are entranced. It's almost as if there are limbs pushing oh, no. and pulling within the red, but it's it's so distant, it's hard to tell. But it's as if things are, are pushing and expanding from inside this cloud. And then it just looks like a, a cloud again, but more a roiling fog. I've already said it, what it is. you know what it is. I is did. it still <laughs> red? Is yeah. it still red? Which is for a moment we see the it limbs. Is, it is then. a bright, bright blood red, and it is separate and distinct from all the other clouds, which now storm clouds have come in around it, below it, and are starting to rain. It's partially obscured, but even as the ship continues to move and the other clouds overhead pass by, this one stays in the same place Ooh. relationally to you as the ship continues like it's to it's following move. us. Oh, you're following it? Um, how did y'all do this? Is this more yarn? Yeah, how did you do it? Iron eyes can understand the... Let's see if iron eye liked it. <laughs> we did, we did, we did. I'm gonna, I'm gonna find my barrel. Your barrel? Your barrel? He walks off. <laughs> now do you think that's for drinking or for pooping? Yeah, I hope not both. After um, a bucket's different than a barrel. <laughs> I don't know about words. <laughs> I don't yeah, have maybe you do. <laughs> we don't do either from either. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh, after standing for just a minute, kind of having forgotten myself staring at it, I'm going to come back to myself and start. Is Edward still? He's climbing down from the rigging. Okay. Eyes locked on you. OK, I'm just going to I'm going to start climbing up to meet him part way. Uh, I Probably didn't, uh, Edward, what? I was coming down the shroud. I mean, as soon as I got up there, it's just like I was I was talking to Pelly one yeah. second, and then I turned, and it was there. And is that what made you scream? You just saw this red, did you see? I just want you to know, uh, yeah, no. Anything I, in it? I thought it was just me. I thought, I thought it was just my mind playing tricks on me, but yeah. I, What'd you see? I saw my mother's face. 
She's been dead a long time. Ooh, this is so spooky. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I, I didn't. Yeah. I wasn't trying to perform for you. That's really not part of it. No one told me. No, of course not. Keep going. Oh, no, no. So immersive. <laughs> okay, but she died horribly. Uh huh. <laughs> uh, and, My whole family worked in a factory. We cut to the factory. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> there's a, a giant machinery moving a conveyor belt yeah. full of. There's just one chocolate every few feet down. <laughs> Mom, are you sure? I don't think you need to go in the machinery and get that one chocolate. It's fine, Edward. I love you. <laughs> It'll be fine. We have to keep this job if we're going to feed the rest of the 12 members of our family. <laughs> Crunch! <laughs> Mom! <laughs> anyway, oh, that's no. what happened. <laughs> I felt like I was there. Compelling. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> what a Edward, you don't have to put your own trauma on display for other people's entertainment. That's not true. That's, that's exactly what we're paying for. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> I saw... I saw limbs in it, like arms and legs and mm -hmm. stuff. <laughs> and they were like twisting around and like mm. interacting yes. with each other in like a weird, like Slipping, they were like- Slipping, sliding. Yeah. Like, like yeah. many bodies like all in one cloud. many bodies all in one cloud. And then it was gone and then it was normal. Are you okay though? <laughs> you saw it too, right? Wait, what do you mean? I don't think I am. I'm, I'm gonna go lie down in one of the hammocks. Okay, just. All right. I'll be there if you. <laughs> or oh, at... <laughs> oh my! In... Wait, I just wondering, how do you get two people into those hammocks? You know when two limbs slip and slide again? I do. I oh, you make a red cloud. Got it. <laughs> okay, not a. It's not comfortable. Not us. We're just wondering. We make it work. Okay. Hmm. With a little. No, I don't know. You have to. The rain starts to pour all the around. Yeah. Oh. So did you practice? What did you? You saw the like arms and legs pushing out of there. What? <laughs> no. No, is it? No. no. You, you. I saw arms no. and legs too, sweetie. I don't want. I mean, <clears throat> my friend. I don't. <laughs> yes, Rowena. <laughs> yes. Uh, I look. It's suggestion. If they say there's arms and legs slipping and slide, sleeping and sliding, uh -huh. uh, <laughs> then of course you're gonna see. That it's just a cloud. Oh well, it was. It was before they said it. Um, but I, that's why I was asking how they did it. It, it was very mm. impressive. It looked incredibly realistic. It was much better than the hand with the yarn. Arr, it's still terrible. Terrible. If you jump up from behind your bear's paw. It gets me every time he, just, he moves suddenly. That's because of the man missed. moving fast. Right. Oh. He's taking a nap. Oh. Are we men uh, move. hungry <laughs> for more spaghetti bolognese? Just then the rain starts pouring down. Oh. Oh. The spaghetti oh. rain, <laughs> a downpour. It, it starts coming down in a sleeting, hailing. Uh, it was warm oh. a few minutes ago in the, the air or, yeah, you know. Uh, and, and as it comes down harder, the crew around you starts to run. Uh, people are calling for you to help on the rigging. A yeah. few crew people go to grab the helm along with the helmswoman, and they're all needing to push against this helm uh, to keep the boat moving forward as the waves begin to rock underneath you. Everyone give me a roll for Dex. Ooh. <clears throat> oh, God. <laughs> yeah, baby. I want different dice. Can I use my? It's too late. I got a I got, nine. <laughs> I got a 90. <laughs> oh, that's beautiful. Mm. Together. Uh, opposites. Uh, okay, great. Owls. Uh, you fall to the ground prone and take two HP damage. Oh my god. No. What? We that have like nine hurts. hit points, just to make that clear. <laughs> it's nine. Nine. Oh, okay. Ish. We only have nine-ish. Or eight. Because yeah. my con is low. Uh, <clears throat> but I got an extreme success. Because I'm, I'm oh, climbing yeah. up in the, I'm, I'm holding on. This is my whole, this is my thing. Yeah, absolutely. You you grab a hold of the <laughs> I'm shrouds over. and climb your way up. That's the lattice laddery thing. Thank you. Yeah. I got an extreme success. Can I also grab the shrouds? Yeah, tell me, tell me what you want to do. Uh, I reach out and see. <laughs> Mabel dropping. I go, my dart! And I just kind of grab out of instinct. And I'm just swaying and looking at you and going, my friend! My darling friend! Uh, my darling friend, my are you okay? Dearest.
friend. Yes, I'm, I'm quite all right. Thank you very much. I would love to say that you look beautiful in the ring. It's pale. Just as a friend would. Wow. We got to go. Did you pass your decks? Uh, I failed. I'm, I'm holding spaghetti. You are holding <laughs> spaghetti. <laughs> One HP damage as you slosh to the side. Uh, it's now spaghetti. <laughs> When you're trying to catch it, you, you uh, touch your own face. Oh, he's everywhere. Do you have a serving utensil or a knife on your hand right Knife. Now? <laughs> Just barely grazes your cheek. Oh, nailed it. <laughs> okay. I got grazed by a knife and took one. <laughs> I fell down. Yeah. Oh, uh, wait. Because my uh, lover friend caught me, did I still take that damage? Uh, with their, with, she did have an extreme Well, success. I was going to take it back, but then I was like, you already wrote it, but then, yeah, you asked. Oh, I so, did it in Yeah, pencil. you can erase it. Yeah, that'd be fine. You were caught Amazing. by your lover. An extreme success. It gets yeah. benefits. We're friends. <laughs> Please. We're friends. With benefits of extreme Living. success. Yes. Uh, supporting each other rent. in the world. <laughs> Looking out for mm -hmm. travel buddy. Uh, uh, the ship continues to move and rock. What do you do, Birdie, to help your crewmates? Yeah, so I'm just uh, tying down. What are you doing over there? I'm just so proud of you for saying crewmen. <laughs> I said crewmates that time. Oh, yeah, I know, but just in general. Seamen. Oh. <laughs> what is there the opposite is. of that? There it is. <laughs> what, what, Sorry. What's, are you proposing? <laughs> no. Don't worry no. about it. I want to. Well, it's not it's really a friendship ring. Yes. I'm like tying, battening down the hatches, you know, that's what they say. Uh, no, I'm like tying down the, um, the sails because um, we need to obviously pull them in so that they don't, so that we can control what we're doing in this wind. Uh, and I am. That's correct. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Uh, so I'm, I'm mostly working on that and just trying to make sure that uh, we're not catching the wind in a way that is going to damage the ship or take us off course. Uh, as, uh, great. As Thank the you. rain comes down harder and harder <laughs> uh, and begins sloshing, you hear uh, the, the captain <laughs> yell, Man overboard! Everyone help! Please get the ropes! There you see uh, a splash off the bow side of the ship. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. Port. Port. <laughs> Port. Port side of the ship. I don't know. That's what we're drinking in the flask. <laughs> yeah. uh, what do you do? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, yeah, I'd love to get a clear view. Yeah. I want to see the action. Do you run to the port side of the I'm going to grab a lantern first, since mm. my good friend Mabel needs a clearer view. Uh, yeah. Uh, mm. uh, to just shine the, overboard. The stairs down from the deck where the, the, the mess hall is, there was two lanterns hanging on either side, gas lamps. Chef. I will uh, switch out the chef knife for the hook yeah. that I have. Please put Are your you inventory, anything man? you can <laughs> put on that hand. Oh, so this one. Yes, I'm going fishing for the man overboard. <laughs> we'll go ahead and do it. <laughs> okay. Do it. Uh, are you ready, Chef? The captain comes over to you and <laughs> takes a rope and starts tying it around your ankles. Thank oh. you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready, uh, just like we always do. <laughs> well, what's the name Wait. of the word? What's the word? Shibari. Up Shibari, thank you. Uh, <laughs> uh, oh, Chef name. Shibari, <laughs> she, that's your new name. That's my, okay. Yes. Uh, a little tighter, please. <laughs> <laughs> we want you to be safe. You're our only hope. Please jump in. Uh, that was Joseph. Our medical person, you know. <laughs> oh, and Joseph is overboard. Yes, please. Please help him. Okay. Uh, and then a few crew mates, if anybody else would like to help. I, as soon as I hear someone's gone overboard, I freeze. I'm just suddenly like clutching onto the netting that I'm on, on the uh, rigging. Oh, no. uh, Already. Fully like. As your fear of water. What? Comes. <laughs> <laughs> That, why do you think I like to spend my time up in the rigging? It's high. You could have a you could have a land job. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know what it's like in this time. Look, we can go into my whole backstory, but I got a single dad. I will giggle through it, don't we? <laughs> we got to your Come childhood. <laughs> dad, I don't want to go 
called your dad. The only yeah. way, Dad, I don't want to go. But the only way for any of us to make any money now that you're injured in the factory, oh. you know, the chocolate factory. <laughs> and you oh, no, someone anymore. help my mom. Someone jump in after her. Oh, I'm going to go. <laughs> no, Dad. We're, now we're going back to my trauma. I saw that happen a different time. And I went, I will, I can crunch. Ah. You can't work anymore, but I can. And I'm going to go out on that boat, and I'm going to make a way for us. And one day I'll get over my fear of the water. I love you. Daughter. I love you, Dad. Hey, we're not going to have a weird daddy issue thing. This is a good relationship. Yes, it is. Yeah. Setting yes, is forbidden, yeah. you will be asked to leave. <laughs> uh, <laughs> cutting back to the present day, I'm like, I still Take haven't it. gotten you over can step the fear of the water. <laughs> uh, please roll for sanity as the possibility of one of the few crewmates aboard the ship never coming back out of that. Can you imagine seat. falling over into the water of a storm? And drowning and mm -hmm. never being. This is exactly what Birdie's imagining right now. Let's see if you. <laughs> it's in 94. Ooh. <laughs> and my sanity is um, 38. So. Uh, can oh. you please roll the sanity damage for me with a d6? Mm -hmm. d6. <clears throat> Don't right. worry, Birdie. That's I'm right. going overboard to get them. No. <laughs> my best friend. A d8. <laughs> They're best oh. friends. <laughs> Fascinating. A six. Oh, gosh. Oh, oh, gosh. Okay. As you do that, I need to find an insanity table. Um, but you know what? We won't need that so long as you would like to tell me how you go temporarily insane. Oh, but first, hold on. There's one more thing we have to do before you go temporarily insane. Oh, I'm yeah, 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 yeah. Because maybe I'm dumb and I don't even know what's happening, right? I can make an intelligence check. That's exactly correct. Right. You <laughs> might be dumb. And right now, this is... <laughs> This is why Call of Cthulhu is great. This is a check you would like to fail by rolling high, because if you're not smart enough to figure out... Your intelligence is really high. <laughs> oh, I know exactly what's going on. <laughs> my own mortality flashes before my eyes. My limbs seize up around that rigging, and the rain that's pelting is suddenly like I am in the water. I am drowning. I am convinced that the water that is not actually entering my mouth is entering my mouth and filling my lungs, and I cannot take a breath. And I, <gasps> yeah. I'm going to say, you even uh, open your mouth and put your head back as you're Letting crying, getting waterboarded. Yeah. water as I'm like, <gasps> yeah. like a turkey. As you stay there, <laughs> that's just happening. You're about to be thrown into this water. <laughs> Good luck. Mm -hmm. Y'all yeah. are just watching? Uh, I would love if there's just some loose rope. I'm like, okay, this is weird. I feel like Bernie's centering herself in this moment. Uh huh. Uh, but I would love to just try to start to build a little lasso. Okay, perfect. I, I, I'm not convinced that this isn't somehow part of it. And I'm like, oh, I can be in it. I can be a part of it. Yeah. Uh, Has well, Rowena ever lasso. used a lasso before? Rowena yeah. comes from a like <laughs> horse like training family. Oh. So uh, yeah, that's what the little split is for. So Ooh. she's just like, well, I could just you know do a little, and then she just whips it and like makes a perfect lasso. She's so, great with a rope. Yeah. Thanks. Roommate. Uh, the captain steps up. I to do you. a little like flick, and it like a little bit catches like right around your ankle, and I just give a little. <laughs> Captain Alia steps up to you and says, I know you're new, I know you're a passenger. I don't want to be in touch. <laughs> you're not a sea woman. <laughs> she doesn't like being touched. Continue. I, re I reached in your direction. I didn't actually touch. It was a gesture. Yeah, I was just warning. Please continue. <laughs> Thank you for telling me. I won't do it again. Totally fine. I won't even intimate like I'm going towards... This is such a time-sensitive moment. Look, you're <laughs> aboard my <laughs> ship, and her beautiful yeah. hair flows. You're gorgeous. It looks dry even in rain. It doesn't make sense. <gasps> She's stunning, and she looks at you with these piercing, uh, kind of lavender eyes. I need you in this moment with your rope. So my roommate and I saw you from across the ship. <laughs> and we just want to know if we could get like a third There's gamut. no time for that. Sorry. Roll Woo! your lasso. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Can I try and like hold on to Rowena while she does it? <laughs> like mm -hmm. I just like while she's like lassoing over, is that, I want to like stay. Is it, yes. is, does she definitely lasso better that way? Because maybe you get a bonus die. <gasps> yes. Okay, so you can roll. <laughs> yeah, of course. Then. What's my bonus die do? Okay, so a bonus die means you roll the tens place again, but your ones digit will stay the same. Oh, amazing. That was the wrong. <laughs> it was yeah, one, one different. 38. We're, we're under, but we're not like a great success. Yeah, 
Your tans. I'm very confused as well. Yes. Your no. tans. Oh, yeah. roll the tans. So you roll a tens digit again because that could potentially be. Oh, it was so much better. Got it. Now it's an 18. Thank you. I'm a dullard. Here for you. No. This one is no, got flipped because you rerolled this one. Yeah. Okay. Okay. It was an 18. Yeah. We did it. It was an 18. Yeah, with an we 18. We got there together. I rolled every die twice. <laughs> <laughs> Chef. This is not the first time your ankles have been tied on this ship, but it is the first time you have had 100% confidence in how secure that binding is. In fact, I think there's like some braids in this row. Oh, you are tying me up. Yeah. Around your ankles. Oh, yeah, yeah. Or wherever you prefer. No, it works, it works. Joseph is drowning! Uh, and uh, Aelia leaves the semen as they throw you overboard and all. You had to say it and I'm so proud of you. Hey, yo. Uh, Wee! <laughs> now, did Splash. we talk about the part where there's only one grabbing hand and the other one's kind of a danger? Yeah. Okay. Uh, well, you, the they, they put the hook on on purpose. Okay. Mm. <laughs> Yeah, no, you got the hook. Uh, okay, so um, as the, the, the crew people hold the rope, uh, it is tied at the other end to a secure place on the boat. They've done this before. But I want everyone just to roll to see how well they're uh, holding onto this rope in just a moment. That's going to reel her back in. What am I rolling? <laughs> You're under the water. You plunge in. It's my worst nightmare. Uh, and... Birdie would hit this. <laughs> <laughs> you see uh, some lanterns on the ship moving about, but it is pitch dark in this water. You can hardly see anything. All you can do is feel around. Give me a swim roll as you swim towards the place where people pointed they saw the splash. 40% is like an okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's yeah, great. You're great at that. You can do this. You're okay. I believe in you. 32. Let's go! 32. Woo! No, don't snap, but it's so weird. Remember, remember, oh, the ha remember the hairless part? Yeah. This is where Ooh, it comes yeah. in. <laughs> you you move like a porpoise. <laughs> <laughs> you move like an oiled porpoise through that water. Yeah. Uh, and and as, you, as you reach out in front of you, you feel uh, the canvas of a rain jacket that the other crew was wearing. You know it. Joseph, like, this is Joseph. Joseph. Uh, you, you, you can't see anything, but you're holding on to what feels like an arm. Oh, that makes me nervous. <laughs> when you say it like that, I don't like that. Feels like. It feels like it might be an arm. <laughs> if everyone, uh, what, what is the signal you give? I give a signal. Oh, yes. To pull. <laughs> oh, yeah, hold on. First thing to I'm know, to hook. what do you grab with you? I'm, I'm hooking the rain jacket. It's a color, hopefully. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if I it don't is, know. does not seem secure. I feel like I, the K was because I feel like I should make you roll when you're trying to save someone with a big with a hook. hook. <laughs> See, when I said it, you all wanted to be Okay, that roll no, no, for your, right. you roll for your utensil you use to do dexterous things that is screwed onto your... Is, it, is that my hand steps yeah. here? Okay, great. <clears throat> no problem. I would like to just, yes, very, very close to the neck. <laughs> Grab the collar. 25. Very Which good. is uh, the one hard? that's in between. Yeah, hard, hard success. success. <laughs> <laughs> Ow! It hey, is we were, hard. Yeah, we <clears throat> All right, uh, do, how do you give a signal to the crew above? I, um, shoot, I don't have a flare gun. We'll it's say you swim. <laughs> they see your head emerge. Yes, and my everyone bald head emerges. Like You're a, bald? Like a bald, I'm hairless. <laughs> oh, like eyebrows too? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> because I shave them, not because I don't have them. Okay. Is it true? Alopecia mm. is chill. I just, yeah, also mm -hmm. shaving it. That's also great. Okay. Uh, if everyone can roll, uh, we're going to be reeling in a rope. So let me know what you think this roll is. Let me see. Wait. Oh, it could be. Let's just roll. Oh, you can your lasso, roll. right? Yeah. Strength, can I use lasso? Right? Oh. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, your rope Sweet. skill, whatever oh. that is to you. Uh, 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 it's a nine, I got an extreme success. Oh, yes. You are so Ooh. good. Thank you. I'm gonna be honest, I'm not helping. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I think I stop you and I'm like, no, no. <laughs> Edward failed. Oh. Edward. 
because uh, his uh, palms were getting ooh, yeah. rope burn, and he pulled away. Uh, but you were able to gloves. real chef in. Yeah. 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 How are you doing? <laughs> it's like upside down. <laughs> uh, I knew it's it. not I my first that. rodeo. And uh, I give like a little whistle and like kind of lever over the side of the ship to like get a little leverage no. to bring them both back up and over. I'm so sorry, Birdie. I forgot to check how many rounds. You're insane. Eight. <laughs> <laughs> hey, can you go check on Birdie? Yeah, sure. <laughs> I want to hear what happens. Do you climb up? Oh, uh, I'm just gonna stand. At the, are you up on the like ladder? I'm in the like in the rigging, so I'm like probably like about here ish. Okay, I put one the foot shrubs. on the first ring of the ladder and one arm as high as I can reach, and then uh, hey, from down here. Um, how you doing up there? I, uh, I, I, I can barely even register, but I just, there's all this water built up in my mouth, and I look oh. down and just have an extra bit of rain water oh. pours down on you as I'm like, <laughs> explosion. <laughs> Give me a second. How do you down there with your mouth open like a turkey? <laughs> <laughs> help, help. Yeah, you because know, I'm drowning. Give me a sanity check to see how you respond. Give me a psychology check just to see if you're able to uh, get through that. Okay. <laughs> Something good as I can. In the peas. I'm really good at it. Yeah, yeah. I succeeded. I, I got succeeded. A 20 out of 65. So as this water pours out of me, it's kind of enough to, to clear my lungs, but I start to kind of come come back to myself and see what I that there's a person, one of these new passengers is standing down there. I've, oh, I'm not I'm not drowning. I'm a pie. I'm a pie where it's safe. With a hard success, can I just try to like call like contribute to calming her down a little bit. Like, do you want to maybe come on down a little bit? Because it's actually more dangerous and you're more likely to fall into the water from there? <laughs> <laughs> you tell her, babe. Roll for sanity like, because that is where you would spend most of your life. <laughs> like, I was just thinking of the boat, like, you know, capsized or something, whatever that's called. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Okay, but you're really good at psychology, so it's in a comforting voice. <laughs> As this is happening, the boat continues to lift, list uh, with huge waves underneath See you. See that? <laughs> and as uh, you are pulled up, Chef, your feet come first up visible up over the edge of the railing, the beat up railing on this old ship, and, and you're dragged back aboard as hanging from your hook. Oh, no, 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 no. Coming second is the figure of a man wearing okay. a dark black trench coat. Okay, but full. All full body? Is it all of it? Uh, there are <laughs> pants, there are shoes. No, no not the uh, There's a hood. <laughs> and, but he's face down. Okay, but it's, it's a full but, human. But it's yeah, not I didn't just, just like bring an out arm. a single there arm. There is a face down figure not moving on the deck. Okay, okay. Um, Your mm. ropes are still tied. Once we are on board, I'll hop to Joseph. <laughs> They're like a mermaid. You can just walk. They're ankles. I didn't tie them together, that's insane. Oh. <laughs> I, I was also picturing them tied together. I think we all, raise your hand if you thought they were tied together. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. You're and all then. wrong and bad for that. <laughs> I thought they were like a mermaid. Yeah. <laughs> that's why. Was it dolphin? You know what, it is that. They're and I aerodynamic and smooth, <laughs> right? right? So you only I need hop one over fin. to Jose. <laughs> Wait, who's at the end of my hook? Never mind. I just. Flip Joseph around. Uh huh. Face up. Oh, okay. Okay. Is is Joseph breathing? <laughs> the cloaked figure. Uh, as it turns over, you see sockets where oh. eyes should oh. be, <laughs> an opening maw uh, where a mouth could be placed, no. but it looks more like a jack o' lantern. No. And all around, creating the face are slithering tentacles, eels, small eels <laughs> slithering against each other. You heard the snaps? <laughs> Go Why on. Why did I give you this power? Go slithering on. tentacles of eels. I think that's probably already uh -huh. there. They're uh, slimy black mm -hmm. eels yeah. make up the face. Yeah. Roll for sanity. Uh, you two were doing something else, but yes. I think you were yeah. right there having Absolutely. just. I'm robot. insane again already. I'm having all kinds of breaks with reality. Driving. <laughs> Thirty nine. I'm living my best life. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Uh, I fail. Fifty five. <clears throat> okay. Uh, as you see, 
this thing, you lose only two okay. sanity points. Um, and all of you soon become aware because Edward starts screaming the most high-pitched ah! scream you've ever heard, especially from a mask-presenting person. Uh, <clears throat> as everyone on the crew runs over to help and then immediately in revulsion turns away and starts hurling over the side of the ship or, or running in fear because the cloaked figure what? No. stands. No. Oh. <laughs> Uh, like Michael Jackson style without m m using yeah. his feet, just from Can't horizontal fight. to vertical. Joseph, are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay, Joseph? Thank you. Andrew, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. <laughs> nope. Joseph is not okay. <laughs> uh, uh, the, the shroud falls away and arms are made up of uh, uh, small crabs and all other insects as oh, <clears throat> the creature grows in size and you can see it's made up of sea creatures uh, dripping massive tentacles, tendrils, claws and suckers, pseudopods, Why? filaments <laughs> and pincers. You heard the steps. <laughs> it resembles an, an, enormous, an enormous nest of bloated, squirming serpents winding and wriggling in different directions. And the stench hits each of you in the face. If you weren't facing it, you turn when you smell it. It's like seafood left out to spoil, like put in the microwave for hours. It smells like our room. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, chef. at home or on the ship? <laughs> on the ship. You, push, you put us in the fish room. You did put us in the fish room. I uh -huh. did. I did. Mm -hmm. Anyway, uh, roll for sanity. <laughs> Again? Again? No, no, not if you already rolled. Okay. So when we, you see the thing. Um, can I use When you smell it, you turn. That. I'm like, oh, I'm back to myself. Uh, oh, God. Oh, dear. Oh, 12. Nice. This is normal ocean stuff. I'm fine. <laughs> you're cool with. <laughs> Interesting. I'm just numb at this point. I've been through a lot in the last Honestly, fair. eight minutes. So. You may now come down from the shrouds should you choose. Your I will. I'll start to come down. Yeah. I feel by 10. By, by 10? Oh, this is a great time to tell you all. You have a resource. Mm -hmm. It's called luck. Mm -hmm. And I'm a nice keeper, so I'll let you spend it on whatever you want. Oh, one for uh, one. No limits? Uh, here's the thing. All of you have 30. either 20 or 25 luck. In, yeah. uh, except for me, I have 30. I have. OK, well, not that much. Uh, <laughs> OK, you have the most. And you may spend it one for one to make any of your rolls succeed or make a regular success a hard success, mm. etc. However, if there is a situation in which I don't know if the thing you're looking for is there or not, I will make you roll using your luck score. So you're taking away from your ability to be lucky later. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to use it right now. I'm just going to take that failure. When you see <laughs> this horrible sea creature, which legitimately, never mind, I'm not even going to say, <clears throat> it is my deepest fear, crustaceans. Uh, oh, no. One in specific, don't say it, don't say it. If you know, don't say it. Don't tell, the internet has too much power. I'm starting to, to sweat them, just don't. thinking about it. Okay, um, this, is, this, is like a, this is like a big bad, so this is a D8. Oh. Why? Okay. It's a two. <laughs> Whoo! You lose two sanity. So you do not okay. go temporarily insane as you look on. But tell me, what is Mabel thinking? Um, Mabel, who up to this point hasn't really taken it particularly seriously and just is like, this crew is just full on bananas, um, <laughs> turns immediately from, as she hears the shriek, uh, turns to look for Rowena uh, and instead catches the sight of this thing. Uh, and she goes to move towards her. It, her instinct, everything, is to get to her, but freezes completely in place. And you can mm. see her hand start to reach out but hold there unable to move towards it or away from it. Um, and then after it kind of breaks, she runs to you and goes to like pull on your arm to get back down to the room. So you're running towards uh, below decks? It's either that or off the side. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Cut the rope, cut the rope. <clears throat> Wait, let me switch up, mate. I want to take the hook off, <laughs> put on the chef's knife. Can I use my knitting needle and just? <laughs> <laughs> cool, cool, cool. Can everybody tell me their decks? 
real quick? Oh, no. Great. Oh, mine is 75. Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. 45. Also 45. 60. Okay. Cool, 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 um, cool. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Where, okay. is, where is Captain Hornswallow? While this is happening, uh, Horny Swallow was <laughs> helping with uh, the rope. No, she wasn't there because that was Edward. She went to talk to the helmswoman, Helga. Okay, of course. Helga, well, the helmswoman. I just didn't know if our captain um, had uh, orders or something inspiring to say to help us all. Or, uh, can so I was just wondering if I. This uh, is your captain! <laughs> and as you look, that her hair. Even have to. Her hair looks incredible in the so screen. Good. Uh, uh, you're, uh, everyone take cover, please get, get guns, get, officers get guns, and uh, she pulls out her pistol, she probably called it a pistol, that's what she said, <clears throat> and starts putting gunpowder in it. It's All right, we've got a rifle. <laughs> I don't have a rifle with me, but I am very skilled with one. Uh, roll for luck to tell me if you find one. Let's do uh, I don't have a lot of luck, though. Oh, you got it? Okay. <laughs> It's a 36, and my luck total is 30. Well, you can't spend luck on luck. That doesn't That's, make sense. It's bad that we, sh we should be able to do that. <laughs> How do I do that? <laughs> Physically, I would let you if I could. <clears throat> uh, OK. I'm thinking about stealing all your health points instead. Never mind. That's not how the game works. It's a rule. You can't spend luck okay. um, on luck. Fair. <laughs> You're breaking my. I'm rolling for sanity. <laughs> <laughs> Roll on your own sanity. I passed. Great. Good. Oh. Uh, as this thing starts reaching in all directions, it's as if maybe these sea creatures making up a body before were packed in very tightly, and as they expand, oh. the thing grows more and more till it stands 15 feet above the deck and the empty hole where the mouth should be lets out a <laughs> like it's laughing at you Ooh. as it reaches up and the red cloud above seems to be coming down closer it's like two tornado spirals of red mist come down towards its hands reaching up towards this it's weird that. heaven. We gotta yeah. go. <laughs> yeah. And uh, oh, no. uh, you see those that saw the limbs moving before see them push now. Hey, if we didn't see the limbs before, is this not scary? <laughs> Roll for sanity. Dang it. 40. Yeah. But I'm good. Great. Uh, and then you saw the limbs. I saw you did not. <laughs> Give me a roll for sanity. <laughs> I'm good, 17. Nice. Look, That's the cool. cloud can only take so much sanity, yeah. so it's fine. Uh, All things considered, it is just a cloud. Um, the thing reaches out to the closest <laughs> person. Poor baby Edward. Oh, no! Nay, 18 years old, no. this lad. That is a man grown. Uh, yeah, <laughs> I'm dying no. at 38. Is this, yeah. is this him, is this the attack or is that him defending himself? That's the attack. Okay, good. I mean, yes. The thing. <laughs> so much. Sorry. We're kind of on the GM screen. I'm cheating. I forgot to bring. Uh, <clears throat> uh, the thing swipes at Edward, and it's as if it, it doesn't know how to move all as one. These are individual creatures learning to be one horrifying monster. That was its left hand. <laughs> no. Oh, no. With its right hand, it sweeps outward and extends otherworldly <laughs> behind a barrel. And no. the crabs that had been attached, sort of the whole arm detaches, and uh, crabs, snakes, creatures, all scutter behind said barrel. No. And you hear another scream, this one more guttural, more aged. Oh. Perfect. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, let's go ahead and take that one yeah, more time. Yeah. Get more <laughs> okay. As you hear the ripping and rending of flesh behind that Gosh. barrel. Uh, Birdie, Whoa. you have the highest dexterity, so you can move the quickest should you choose to want to do something. 
I will run to the barrel where Iron Eye is, uh, where his screams are, to see if I can pull crabs and things off of him. Maybe sure. it's not too late, so I'm going to run over there. You run to... behind the barrel, and you see the flask on the ground open and spilling out. Um, you're, you're rolling to, to flick crabs away? Yeah. Sure. Basically to like get to see if I can pull them off of him and, and, and chuck them. I don't know. It's not quite a fighting roll. I feel like it's more of a dex roll, but I want a yeah. hard success. Okay. So this needs to be a 37 or lower. <laughs> when I get there, I am so horrified by the sight of these water creatures ripping, I assume, the flesh off of Iron Eye that I, I go to try, I can't even, like, they're, I go to try and touch them and they're, like, trying to get at me and I can't, I'm scared I rolled a 94, so. <laughs> But your skill is above 50, so that's not a fumble. Something Thank terrible goodness. doesn't happen. If you roll 95 or higher. Ooh, so <laughs> close. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, it has to be, never mind. Don't yeah. worry, uh, details. It's fine, it's fine. <clears throat> Great, uh, next. So it's, that was bad, I'm not helping at all. You're not Poor Iron helping Eye. at all. As, uh, you know what, you did go around the barrel though, and you do see these <gasps> tiny crabs cover his face. Yeah, there you go, you know. <laughs> how many, how many a d6 or more? Well, uh, I'm gonna come go on, insane, Becca, Do it, Becca. <laughs> Becca, Becca, look at me. I think it's just here. No. I don't know what were your. I think you liked Iron Eye, and I think you're saying it's flesh being eaten by tiny crabs, so that sounds like a d8. Is it two? Okay. Mm -hmm. It's fine, I have 31 points of sanity left. It's I fine. mean 30 points of sanity left. Rowena. <laughs> I got nervous when you looked at me. <laughs> uh, if you cut the, the rope free, uh, I, oh God, yeah, let's make a big mistake. Uh, I wanna grab the free rope and my intention is to lasso around its head and run off the side of the boat and bring the whole thing down with Ooh. me. Ooh, you're running off the side yeah, of the boat? Yeah, I'm gonna try to jump off the ship. I feel like, Seeing the like connection between the cloud and um, the like a delicious seafood stew monster in front of us, I want to try to sever the connection by pulling it back into the water and hoping that I don't die. Okay. Uh, so you are, this is just freestanding rope, it's not attached to the boat, you're yeah. lassoing the crab monster, and you, you can run and jump in the water for free. Yeah, it's yeah, that idea sure. of like lassoing around its front and then running behind it to pull it yeah, like, back over the side of the boat. Yeah, real situation. Yeah, 100%. Okay, give me a lasso <laughs> roll, but yeah, I'm gonna need a hard success because okay. this is a pile of snakes and crabs. A pile of snakes and crabs. That is 15 feet in the air. I did not get a hard success. Wait, use How luck? much luck can yeah. I spend? As much as you want. Okay. Use it all. <laughs> yeah, I can get do? there. Okay, I'm at a 54. I have to do an amount of math, and that's hurtful. <laughs> it's 18 points to get there. I'll spend 18 of my luck do to do it. <laughs> do it. <laughs> okay, that you have seven luck. remaining. Yeah. Yep. Cool. Pencil. 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 The luck goes forever. It's just gone. <laughs> there we go. Uh, the rope lashes around the thing's neck once, twice, three times. It's on there. You yank backwards, and uh, this thing is unable to dodge it as you run off the ship. I give a Not look the to port, Mabel. but the starboard. Yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> what's the look? Yeah, I look back. I'll be back. And then she just runs and grabs it. And I think you just see her like leaning back. And once she has the leverage, she just gives you a little darling hug uh, and falls off the bed. That's sexy and sacrificial Thanks. all at the same time. Uh, I run to that edge of the boat looking over to see her. Okay. Uh, the, the thing, its head ripped backwards. Crabs go flying as it does. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> but it, there is a, like a loud thud as a humanoid skull, but larger, slams as crabs are flung off of it. Oh. And it is uh, caught on the rope as well and drags over the side with you, um, splashing into the water. The body stands for a moment 
and then splatters uh, and all these uh, horrible field of crustaceans covers the entire ship deck. It's a feast. <laughs> <laughs> I pick them up and start throwing them in the water no, no, away no, no, from you, her. You, 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 uh, if you start singing the <laughs> croissant, I'm drowning myself. They're singing Kiss the Girl! <laughs> yes. Okay. Mabel and Chef, it's both of your turns. Uh, uh, let's so see. many good ingredients! Uh, <laughs> no, I read! <laughs> Whoever wants to go first, uh, let's see. Um, there are still crabs. The crabs recede. They're no longer possessed by some otherworldly thing. They're just crabs, although they have begun more casually eating the face of Iron Eye since they already had a taste for it. But you're able to brush them off one at a time. The crab or Iron Eye? Rowena, you're in the sea. Yeah, during I'm having a, a bad time. Storm. Yeah. Uh, when you hit the water, uh, I'm gonna need you to give me a roll to see how well you landed. Cool. Uh, maybe Con constitution. Oops. What happens when you hit sure, 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 uh, sure. icy cold water real hard? Oh, 74. Not, it's not good. It's not good. It's not great. I think that's a D6 Buh. for the ocean's pain. That's a five oh. HP. Oh. Is that Oof. equal to or more than half your total? Just points? under. So you don't go unconscious. Cool. Uh, oh <laughs> boy. Uh, Mabel, what do you do staring over the edge, looking at your beloved while throwing crabs at her? <laughs> Not at her, I didn't yeah. specify away from her. Thank you away very much. Her. As I was like running by and tossing crabs off the deck, not sure if they were still a part of this thing in some capacity. I'm gonna look over and see if I can get her to like throw her rope back up to me. I'm in the water. You have the rope? Yeah. I don't have the rope. Is there rope on deck? There, roll for luck. <laughs> Please roll good. No. Ooh. No. <laughs> Big fail, no rope. Uh, but, <clears throat> all right, uh, there, there is you, you rope. Have... It's part of the ship's rigging, but mm. that was the one spare rope that had been tied up for the Shabari. Are there any earlier. little lifeboats? <laughs> roll for so when you just rolled There's for There's gotta be something. I've rolled exactly my luck though. <laughs> okay, uh, there is a lifeboat. Okay, great. So I'm just looking around then. Uh, I will uh, jump in a lifeboat and I will <laughs> use my knitting needles to cut the tie. Oh, no, 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 <laughs> oh, no, 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 but do not do it. Wait. No, no, no. <laughs> yeah. do not like, how do we get you back up? <laughs> we have the same decks, right? The storm been continues to rage all around yeah, I, you. The waves are like 20 Just let me lower you down. down. Okay, lower let me, me down. down. <laughs> Every time you see Rowena's head pop up, oh, huge wave I don't bombs. care. I will die for her. <laughs> oh, God. Roommate. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's okay. too horny for snaps. We gotta clap. With the same, with the same dexterity, uh, can I jump in the boat with Mabel as I attach, like a, a <laughs> like we're a gonna pulley? pretend that this exists. Yeah. A pulley, <laughs> like pulley. like an electric whisk, so that we can like. <laughs> What are you gonna do? I will not ocean? allow any, not a single anachronism in the ship. You can get a hand whisk. Uh, yeah, you crank it. Yeah. Okay, a hand okay. crank whisk. Yeah, yeah. 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 I don't know I'll do what you want. I but for that to be in your inventory in this Lower. moment, I'll need a luck roll. Okay, okay, okay. What can I do that would be helpful? Come on. <laughs> you do not have a hand crank whisk okay. you can screw onto here. But clearly I <laughs> have a, like a arm. spatula. What? No, wait. Of course <laughs> you have a spatula. You do have a spatula. What do I mean? Uh, <laughs> I was trying to make a small speedboat. <laughs> wait, why do we need it to be a speedboat? I, I would take a normal boat. boat. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Just, but is, as we're low, yeah, we're to be fine. Raise I'm back up. I'm holding the half-eaten body. I'm going. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I'm yeah. Ignoring yeah. everything we'll else. Pause apparently. this. We'll come right back. Let's check no. on Iron Eye. No. <laughs> I just made it was like a funny thing. Cut to them trying to save, yeah. and me just being like, oh yeah. Birdie, Birdie, snap out of it. Birdie, <laughs> look at me. <laughs> you can see his tongue as Iron he talks Eye. through his oh, cheek, oh, which oh, is oh, going oh, through. Oh, all of that. Yeah. yeah. You don't have the X card. They got the X card. <laughs> <laughs> what do we do? What happened? The day Did these new came. passengers curse the boat? What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. You, 
with my I can't hear anything. Dying I'm breath. busy. <laughs> I will curse them. No. No, no, no. no oh, no. was that not where you were going? No, I just didn't I know what to tell you. I don't know what's going on. I want to tell you. Uh, and please tell, um, I don't have any family, uh, but please well, tell the crew. No, no, look. We've been family. Oh, for, for 15 years, I and I, we've been family. And now I'm just, <laughs> you've always been a little old for me, but there's also been just something. It was never no. like that. You no. were like a daughter. It's yeah, cool. exactly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'd run interference with Edward all the time. Poor Edward. Hey, you're dying, though. What? Oh, no, he was more like this. This is, it's me, I'm dying. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> What do we do? You, give me your, your I will wine. tell you what I do. See, yeah. I believe in you, Birdie. You're going to get to shore. And you're going to get over your fear of the water. But there are people in the water right now, and I don't know how to help them. you, you got to think of something, and you can't be scared, Birdie. And also, remember, the secret of steering a boat through the evil type of storms is... Yeah. Yeah, no, 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 I, I slapped him in the face, no, no, die! You've seen him cry through yeah. his regular eye, but you see a tear form in his iron eye as he looks up, and you see the life is gone. I, I question for Birdie, yeah. when you slapped that side of his face, it was the t side his tongue was hanging out of his yeah. I'm like, ah, yeah. this is yeah. Actually, uh, it was, but the other side also was eaten through, so it just went through to the other side. <laughs> Amazing. Okay, thank you. Sorry, continue. I'm Do gonna, little, like, yeah. I'm gonna get, I'm sorry, this is gross. I'm sorry, everyone. I'm gonna oh. pull his iron eye. I'm gonna get and pull it out of its socket. He does not move because he's nor dead. Act, he's dead. Okay, this is, he told me to be brave. And this <laughs> is now <laughs> my talisman. <laughs> And I, I, don't think that's I put it in <laughs> my pocket. Is there any reason you should not roll for sanity for the gore you just inflicted? That, yeah, because I inflicted it on myself. I was mentally prepared for it. Okay, yeah, I'll take that's that. That's the reason. Sure. I'm a little unhinged at this point. And I, I look around. I'm going to be brave. I'm going to get over my fear of the water. Is there anything that can, I can grab that will help this situation, I, I'm, 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 I, how can I help? Keeper, tell me what to do. What do I find? Spot hidden. I'm, I'm so glad you asked because there is a mechanic in Call oh. of Cthulhu for this. Roll your intelligence because it's also your idea. I rolled a three, which is an extreme success. Let's go! It's because she took the eye. It's exactly, I was like, <laughs> it's an eye. Wait, like, well, that's it's exactly an, what we were going. Oh. It's an eye idea. Don't groan. Yeah, no. I, well, I was going to say that Sorry. as you lift it up yeah. and turn it over yeah. in the back. Ew. <laughs> uh, when you pull off the sinewy muscle that's grown around. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's just like cleaning a fish. Uh, you see an opalescent jewel. <laughs> and if you pluck it out, yeah. as you are compelled to do with this roll, yeah, uh, oh, you, you, hold on, <laughs> you hold on to that jewel. And as you hold it up to your eye, yeah. you can see through it. Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> Give yourself um, one... Cthulhu Mythos point. Whoa. Yeah. I don't even know what that means. It's in the, it's over here. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Uh, you now have a creepy viewfinder. <laughs> and, and an opal. Cool. What do I see? <laughs> Where do you point it? I point it at the lifeboat that is uh, going down uh, to try and help. We'll hold on Birdie looking at stuff with her new toy as we cut to this lifeboat. There is a mechanism. There are pulleys to lower the lifeboat gently and safely. Please, Even my wife. <laughs> the water my below. My best friend. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm dying. We who is around? Who is around to yell? Swear? <laughs> There's uh, Myrna, the the cook's assistant, uh, is the only one to hear you say my wife, and gives 
an eyebrow. My wife. And a wink. <laughs> and uh, hops in the boat to help on the other pulley, because so, you must lower evenly. You were in the boat as well, the lifeboat? Oui. <laughs> <laughs> that was a question. I thought you wanted to get in, but it, maybe it was only with the whisk. Let's help. No, no, no. Thanks. <laughs> Once Myrna's in, you know? <laughs> uh, so the three of you are lowering in the lifeboat. Uh, it seems that the captain as well as Helga Helmswoman are just <laughs> trying to keep the ship from capsizing. Uh -huh. <laughs> would, Her last, yeah. would you like me to fish your roommates? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, I would not. <laughs> Okay. Do you have something other than the hook, maybe? Less dangerous to help? <laughs> Let me and not, a knife, not a knife, either? What would you like to have? Just you look. definitely have a spatula, a hook, and a chef's knife. What else? Uh, do I have... Ooh, the fourth thing. Mm, a very large ladle. <laughs> <laughs> Given that you've already served soup, yes, you do. Yes. Spoon my wife, please. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Wait, I'm sorry. Spoon my roommate, please, I beg of you. It would be my pleasure. <laughs> uh, okay, so I'm gonna need some rolls. I'm gonna need swim roll to make yeah. sure Rowena has it. How are you at swimming? Uh, 35 at swimming. Okay, so nothing. And Arr. then <laughs> roll for spoon? Yeah. <laughs> Uh, and you are, uh, describe how you're assisting. Okay, um, yeah, I'm going to let Chef reach out into the water and I've discovered that there's a system here and I'm gonna hold on to Chef's ankles. <laughs> Get a bonus die. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I think I'm gonna want a hard success though. You're oh. pretty good with that utensil. Um, I did, the first one was a 40, which was a hard success. Yeah. I'm really good with my spoon. 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 <laughs> How did we swim? So badly. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Describe to me, because you are successfully, you've got a ladle. <laughs> no, a woman, hairless woman. <laughs> uh, an, another woman in the boat. How do you get the ladle lower? Because you have not, the waves keep crashing and they had pulled you under. You're, you're, not, you're not drowning, but you're under. Yeah. How do we get lower? I, I, I'm being held by my ankles yeah. off the side of the. I'm gonna, I'm gonna dunk them. Yeah, I, I'm getting dunked, <laughs> and I'm All gonna way scoop. <laughs> it's the old dunk and scoop. Come on, <laughs> scoop Rowena right up. You're gonna have to reach <laughs> for this old dunk and scoop to work. Please. I became the soup. <laughs> <laughs> I told you that's the real horror. Just give me a roll, and then we'll figure out what okay. it is. I don't know. Come on, Maybe do good. Just, you're reaching. It's Dex. No, 55. Well, that's Dex. Oh, Dex? Yeah, that's okay. That's okay. Your fingertips graze the ladle, and you <laughs> what? <laughs> I feel the last of my air. I feel a ladle and go what? <laughs> <laughs> How do you get her up? I wiggle my toes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna start pulling. <laughs> I can't believe they've been barefoot this whole time. <laughs> I'm making it work. <laughs> they haven't invented boat shoes yet. Uh, as you flop onto the lifeboat, Rowena, I... coughing up water, <clears throat> what do you say? <clears throat> what? <laughs> <laughs> We dunk and scoop. <laughs> oh, we all dunk and scoop. <laughs> Don't. Are you okay? I was no. Like, can I, I start no, pulling thank us up? You. Can I do a little first aid? I don't, do you have any damage? No. You're good, right? I'm good. Okay. <laughs> I mean, you I, you failed dead. your swim roll, so yeah. you 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 took some water. Uh, oh, oh, you are half dead, yeah. Okay, yeah. it's a D4 then. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna start pulling stuff to get us out of the water. Okay. Ooh. Oh, wait. I'm past the halfway threshold. In it has to be in one, one fail swoop okay, for cool. you to get unconscious. Otherwise, uh, you can go all the way to zero. Okay, yeah, can you, okay. Do you have first aid? Oui? Ability? It's, yes, yeah, okay. Okay. <laughs> like if you had to rate on a scale from like zero to 100. <laughs> <laughs> It's a 51. Oh, that's pretty good. That's better than I've got. Um, 
Can we help? <laughs> are you gonna Are you gonna pull up? I'm to pulling Jack up. First? Okay. They're, we could just pull you, up. You have to pull them simultaneously. Well, you said that what's her face was on the boat too. Yes. Oh, You're yeah. all on the boat. You yeah. know, to get the lifeboat. The other yeah. 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 Myrna, the other what, what's her face? Myrna is working. Myrna. Myrna, Myrna. She's so quiet. That's I forgot your about assistant. her. <laughs> 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 well, yeah, it doesn't seem to not have a tongue, or was that someone else? Yeah, that's why she said. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> I love horror games. <laughs> um, Are you scared yet? <laughs> I will. Uh, I would like to apply some first aid. I don't know how it works. Yeah, it's how this works. Roll for first aid. Okay, I take out the basic brush. What are you brush. doing? To me? <laughs> <laughs> it's a nine. <gasps> Is it's that extreme? extreme? I yes. Guess. It's extreme. Oh my god. Good thing that the most you can heal with first aid is only one. Oh my point. god. Okay. Yeah. But you know what? With an extreme success, I'll let you add a d4 to that. <gasps> oh. oh, you're so nice. I thought you were trying to kill her. I forgot. Uh, too late. I said it. <laughs> Four. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh. So I get five back? Oh. Yes. <laughs> Okay, 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 the storm picks up. <laughs> uh, Myrna helps you pulley to the top. You've gotten to the top of the deck. Meanwhile, what else have you pointed your talisman at? I pointed it at the crow's nest, which inadvertently led me to looking up at the clouds. I pointed it at the... <laughs> it's too late! <laughs> oh, um, oh. Once you point it... Oh, no. I thought it would be a good thing to do, because I... Why? It's great. Why? I think it would be a good thing to do. Could when you be. point it at the red fog, uh oh. The whole the rain pounding on your face, you, you suddenly can no longer feel it. Yeah. You feel uh, an oozing all around you, oh. Oh. as if as if you've been grabbed yeah. by the cloud. Yeah. They were snapping. So. <laughs> yeah. I have to close my eyes. All of you are too horny. Um, <laughs> this you does start to feel more and more like horny spoken. Word. I wanted this. This nice. is my red ooze. Uh, <laughs> it, as you blink your eyes open through this ooze, mm -hmm. uh, all you see is red in every direction, but you can look around and you are in the red fog. Oh. oh. And uh, you can't even see your hands. You just see faint red outlines. And just beyond, in the distance, you see limbs pushing and pulling and roiling. Mm -hmm. And as you look around, you see like 198 bodies, it seems <laughs> like. <laughs> uh, all in, an, in a mass moving against each other in a serpentine way. Well, come on. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, even better. Yes. Oh, oozing and royally. Oh, this is cool. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I see. I see it. I see it. Yeah. Disturbing. Okay. <laughs> and then, uh, as you continue to blink and move the talisman away from your eye, you're back on the boat dock. But roll for sanity for oh, yeah. what you've just seen. And we're kind of a part of. <laughs> Well, I rolled an 83. Hi. This new insight may be too much for your brain. Uh, you were going to check Sweet out. Bitch. Don't worry, there's many ways to die. Sweet birdie. <laughs> Three sanity points. Now, how many total? Ooh. I'm Ooh. at 27 total sanity points. How, and so you've lost 13. Oh, so you already were supposed to go indefinitely insane. No. Uh, okay. <clears throat> so, I love this game. Yeah. <laughs> right? It doesn't seem PC to take away people's sanity, but it's so much fun. It's good, yeah. actually. We all checked Why? in. <laughs> uh, <laughs> you have seen too much. You have seen things that are beyond the occult, beyond the supernatural, that are uh, from beyond this planet, beyond the scope of your brain's understanding, as it starts to melt out your ear holes a little bit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. Describe to me how, uh, what you decide is the best course of action for the ship as a whole, yeah. and, and how are you are going to 
aid the red fog. Oh. Right. Well, the first thing that happens is I see, I think about Edward, and I see my father's face in the red cloud now. He saw his mother's face. Mm. And thinking about my father reminds me of the compass that he gave me that I wear on a chain. And I grab that and I, I just feel, I don't even have to look at it, I just feel the direction that it's telling me to move in. And I know that that's the direction the ship needs to move in. And it doesn't matter that I've never been a helms person at the wheel of a ship. I've spent my career as a sailor in the rigging. I run to Helga at the helm. Oh, I'm so glad that you and punch I helped me. Punch her oh, we never even met me. We just talked about me. Uh, give me a fighting brawl roll with a bonus die. She did not see that coming. <laughs> she doesn't oh, even get to dodge. Mm. I, I think that's. I never know with that one. That's the good one, right? That's the yeah. Or is that the bad one? Wait, hold on. No, no, that's a 10 and a zero. One. I think that's a, that's a, that's that's a, that's a, a 10. 10. Is there a that triple a, zero on here? I th yes, yeah, there yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was a 10. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I've rolled a 10 and an 80, so we'll go with the 10. I believe you. It's a 10. Okay. No, yes, yeah, because cause there, is a, there is a triple zero on here. Yeah, because that would be the 100. If I had rolled a zero, 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 that's the 100. That's right. Okay, great. I always get it in my... In <laughs> yes. I rolled a 10! <laughs> Which is great. That's yeah, a Decker. That's she a Olm I'm gonna spend out. one luck point. <gasps> oh no, I don't need you because that's eleven. I rolled a ten. That's an extreme success. Uh, you broke her nose and it is <laughs> bleeding profusely. The captain was there helping her to helm, but she rushes to her side and says, "My roommate." <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to bring her to desperately. The helm is yours. I take it and I, whatever direction they were trying to like move it in to study it, I just do the exact opposite. There is in fact a direction you would like this ship to go. Yeah. You are being pulled. That's right. And uh, That's when, right. when you saw, <laughs> yeah, yeah. when you saw your father's face, the cloud jumped 10 feet lower in the sky. Oh no. I know it's been, lingering closer to the boat. It doesn't seem like the other seamen have quite noticed <laughs> what's happening. Yeah. Uh, and, and we'll see if they look up. Okay. What's the rest of you doing? <laughs> Whatever we you did, I yeah. feel great. <laughs> yes. I don't know how you first aided the drowning out of me. <laughs> That's so nice. Special recipe. <laughs> <laughs> that soup is something. That's a good soup. <laughs> right. Okay. Well, I'm going to help you back up to your feet. Yeah. Um, and the storm is still, I'm sure, roaring. So oh, yeah. we're can safe we now. Roaring, yeah. Did we see Birdie like go by and uh, or is this before? And is the, yeah. the boat like Super you know punches. lurching, yeah. changing directions? Did we uh, suddenly feel a? <clears throat> the direction was. Uh, it was as if the waves themselves had been helping in a certain direction, and that is the direction that Birdie wanted to go. That is uh, player knowledge, <laughs> not uh, character knowledge. Mm -hmm. uh, the characters do not perceive a change unless you go looking for it. Do the um, characters perceive <clears throat> the cloud jumping 10 feet down? Right, right. Or a Birdie charging across right. the boat? Or my roommate! <laughs> <laughs> Any of it. Anything okay. draw or 100% you attention. hear my roommate. We have to have heard my roommate. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Everything else, uh, please give me spot hidden rolls. Ooh. Oh, I'm great at spot hitting. That's, I think, an extreme success. Oh my god, extreme success. I got four. Ooh. I have a 23 in my spot hidden. Is a 60, so yeah, this is... 89. Okay. Uh, <laughs> you are just shining your hook. Um, yeah, well, I think I have a basting brush right now, but... Oh, uh, like... you're just basting your hey, brush. You see what's it was the first day. It was the yeah. I don't know why she... Hold on, pause. We gotta go back. What did you do with the basting brush it. that made them feel like... Y'all heard me say basting brush, We did, right? yeah. We okay. heard it. Yeah, I did. You're yeah. right. I missed that. You definitely had that basting brush. We but, um, okay, you all would be the basting brush. <laughs> <laughs> so, that would be the time to change it, which is why I don't notice, perhaps. Yeah, mm -hmm. I think not in the heat of, of uh, a conflict. You can have whatever you want on that. Yeah. Uh, 
they're my roommate. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I think I'm ready to spring into action. Yeah, absolutely. A fall sir. Strong person in danger. Yeah. yeah. Uh, each of you hears. <laughs> What just happened Don't worry about below it. your skirt? Yep, um, sometimes the bottom just falls right out of my roommate, and it's fine. <laughs> I've been doing that a lot. It's very Only when you get out your basting <laughs> We all have them. Okay, uh, back to the scary game. Um, wait, do you vocalize this? <laughs> when, when you hear my roommate, yes. you each look up immediately, turning your heads to where you heard the sound. Yeah, and I then, almost yelled lesbian out loud. <laughs> what? I said, a fellow less. Oh, thank you. Uh, I missed person it. Fortunate person. Fortunate person that needs our help. Uh, <laughs> I get it now. I was yes. making a joke about basting. OK. <laughs> <laughs> when you look up, it's as if uh, the rain seems to let up for just a moment. And looking out the, there's a port, there's a stern, there's the aft, there's a, the fore of the ship. Mm -hmm. Uh, you see straight ahead, perfect symmetry, like it's 2001 A Space Odyssey mm. or something. Uh, straight ahead, in front of the four, each of you sees a vertical slit on the horizon coming in the darkness. It's the middle of night. <laughs> oh, no, I had right I'm, 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 <laughs> Yeah, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> We're all roommates on this ship. Let's head towards. I actually think we might have established something very interesting in this dynamic. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, you continue, <laughs> the ship continues um, moving towards this um, blue oh, no. slit. Oh, yeah, well, this, slit. This, this is not what the ocean normally looks like <laughs> <laughs> when we're sailing in all my years. And um, I think this is bad, very bad. Do you remember when there was a giant sea creature monster? Yeah. We passed the part where you explain that this is uh, okay. a bad situation. <laughs> can we can we walk up to Birdie? Uh, yeah, you can walk up to Birdie. Yeah, uh, Birdie? Uh, the ship seems to be going faster and faster as it has uh, okay. gone oh, no, no, dead no, 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 no. straight okay. forward. Okay. Um, you do notice it's picking up speed now, and the waves seem to be kind of pushing it along, as if you know you're standing in the wind and walking real fast, and it's pushing yeah. right behind okay. you. Turn the boat. Turn the boat different. I'm, there's no, there is no reaction at all. It's like I don't even hear. I am just, I am. Helga. I'm Helga, really turn the boat different. <clears throat> uh, Helga we, is finally them, right? coming to, and Alia, the captain, says, what's happening? Uh, uh, she had taken Helga below to yeah. rest, and she comes oh, back right. up. <laughs> oh, no. Uh, and she tries to Birdie. push Birdie away. Can I also? I will oppose that. Yeah, absolutely. Can I do something simultaneously? Ooh. Sure. Or, or right. Yeah, of course. No, go for it. If you're being held. I apologize. No. Um, no. You get the chef's knife back. <laughs> chef. <laughs> We're friends. We've had seafood for too long. <laughs> <laughs> it's time for a chicken dinner. I would like to cut. You're murdering Birdie. Birdie. <laughs> I feel like you could have gone for like a like a like an arm or like a like a stab in the leg. A stop it. No. <laughs> I, I will go for the neck. Uh, would you like to dodge or fight back, Where Birdie? Really and give me swear? a roll for I chopping with your chef arm. <laughs> I will. Uh. Dodge this. I will try and dodge this. Okay. Oh, look, it's almost over. It's time. Uh, yeah. Uh, <laughs> is it? We got a certain dodge. Maybe last 15. You're going to get a bonus <laughs> die because of your otherworldly strength Thank by you. the cloud. I need it. Yes. Uh, it I will spin two luck points to make it a hard success on a dodge. Okay. Oh, wait. You Can you spin luck on combat? Yeah, you can spin luck. I got a you, you hard success. You can't push your roll, which I didn't even tell you you could do anyway. So that's okay. To. You got a hard success. So two mm -hmm. hard successes. Mm-hmm. Oh. The tie goes to the Dodger. Yes. I'm going to spend seven <laughs> luck points. Had you. I'm going to spend seven luck points. And make it out. Extreme? Extreme. <laughs> they like it. They like it. Traitors. Roll for damage. Oh, yes, okay. <clears throat> Can we get some snaps and, like, how's this horny, though? Yeah. Mm. Thanks. Six damage. 
damage. Six damage. Uh, okay, you take six damage, Birdie, and I believe you drop unconscious. I will <gasps> drop unconscious, but before I do, a moment of clarity comes back into my eyes. And you know like the, in, in Buffy the Vampire Slayer when Angel is at the hell mouth and, then, and, and Buffy's like, I'm gonna kill him, sorry, spoilers. And just, just as- Too soon! Just as they've done it, and just as they've done this spell to bring his soul back to himself, he looks at her and she has to kill him anyway to close the hell mouth, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, it has, has to happen. It's yeah. that mm. kind of a look, I'm like I'm it. Angel looking at you, and I'm like, oh. You just brought up the most dramatic moment it's of a, uh, that I've ever seen. It's uh, second. Second in Buffy. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah. Which is all second to anything from Brave Little Toaster, but we'll talk about that later. I can't yeah. talk about that. Whole after show about Whole Brave Little show. Toaster. I can't talk about Angel that. Angel is less traumatic than I the still... body. I'm just saying it. Yes. Why? And then I fall unconscious. Ooh, that's all. Chup. Roll for sanity as your friend has this moment of clarity. You, it wasn't her. You saw that, but in the moment before falling unconscious, I forgot was that, the real that um, <laughs> I'm. I forgot that I'm immune to sanity losses from viewing a corpse or gross injury. Oh yeah, but this is, is this, emotional. Is this, this is emotional damage. Yeah, but did you? Emotional I forgot about damage. that earlier, but I don't think any uh, human blood has scared you. Does it have to be human? Well, the crab thing is. Um, yeah, 82. Whoop. That's okay, it's not that bad, that's fine. You did it, you know what you're doing. It's a D4. <laughs> come on, come on. <laughs> Amazing. A little sanity punishment, three. Okay. Have you lost more than one fifth of your total starting sanity? I don't know, what's one fifth of 39? Look, it's on your, they math, they math for you. Uh, go to oh, power, it's, it's the same as yeah. power. What, 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 Hold on, how do you have so much more power than sanity? You made this oh. sheet for me, I don't know. <laughs> don't see it. <laughs> she made all our sheet. That's because, uh, okay. Uh, you were supposed to have 50 to start, I'm sorry. 10 is the amount that this? if you lose it. Yeah. I was supposed <laughs> <laughs> How you doing, bro? It's great, you... it's better. Like, I had less to start, so this oh, okay. is good. Yeah, yeah. I'm, have you lost I'm great. 10? Have I, have I lost 10? No, I've total. only lost five. Okay. Okay. Great. That's my question. It's fine. I'm. I'm. Oh, I'm murdered. Let's keep going. Oh, she, yeah. yeah. We should probably keep going because. No, uh, no, no, no. She's not dead. She's just unconscious. <laughs> yeah. Okay. The captain who okay. has come back after <laughs> her helmswoman had been knocked out immediately restrained you. She rolled a 17. Was gonna go for Birdie, but went for you instead. We're so, not uh, driving the boat. I'm gonna jump in and try to drive the boat away from the cloud. Excellent. As soon as you grab the helm and you turn as hard as you can, it doesn't move. Oh, oh God. God. Right. It's as if it's locked in place. That's and bad. you are strong. I'm strong. It doesn't move. Oh, no. Mm-hmm. <laughs> hey, uh, this was going to still be- You give me extreme strength if you would like to try and- Yeah, I'm gonna yeah. try. This was still gonna be like a fun like show thing that y'all are putting on. Now would be a cool time to stop. Yeah. <laughs> it was like ending the ending song like da da. Right. Oh, you survived. You escaped and you timed it. When you say right. cool show or something, Birdie's hand falls to the deck and out of it rolls iron eyes eye. Is that Jesus the eye Christ. from earlier? <laughs> but Oh, I don't like sailing. Roll for sanity. No. Yeah. <laughs> it's not bloody, right? I will not take sanity damage. That's a nine. Oh, incredible. Uh, you, you I'm cover a black lesbian. <laughs> this doesn't bother me. Like, what? This isn't the scariest thing I've seen. It's the olden days. <laughs> This is a mystical, magical olden days where we can have an all-woman crew, yeah, it's and it's cool. like totally yeah, awful. Awesome. It's fine. You're just talking about it. it's our it's our version. Okay. Uh, as, as you realize, there's nothing you can do. You see the eye. You as you look up, up in the distance, it's getting brighter. It's as if the sun is rising, and then you look where that light is coming from, and it is a bright blue fog. What? Pouring out of this vertical slit, <laughs> reaching <laughs> from <laughs> the sea's horizon up as far as you can see, covered, obscured by a cloud. Mabel. You should run. Uh, where? Where in the ocean? Where, <laughs> chef? 
<laughs> Take the light boat and go. Our VIP passengers, they must leave us good reviews. They must get out. <laughs> That's an excellent point. Yeah. 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 I was going to say You're right. Whole, no. You're right. Yeah. 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 The captain. Five stars. The captain is with you. And she is running as her hair flows behind her. What? Uh, you have to go down with the ship. No, I, I will. Of course. Uh, are you telling me this? Yeah. I know. Yeah, it's we not thought you were ship. coming with us. No, we we're leaving. Look. <laughs> we're going. <laughs> Bye. I'm running to help you. I want a really good oh. review. If you could, five stars. <laughs> I understand it was a little rocky. That just in case we make it on the other side. So immersive. Wow. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Bye. 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 Becca. No rolls needed. You are in the lifeboat. You can detach from the police that you've just let yourself do. You need it. Becca, can I can I wake Birdie up? Uh, uh, yeah, you can try and wake them up with a first aid roll. <clears throat> Her. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Not meant to be. What do you do to try to then fail to wake her up? That's a 98. Um, oh. oh, that's a, no, oh. that's a, I know, so I, I still have the chef knife. And, <laughs> <laughs> and it's like, <laughs> I wake up one last time and you pull it and I go, why? <laughs> it's like I forgot that it was, like, that was the attachment. Oh. And Over and was, damage. And I'm like, wake up. It doesn't matter. You definitely do at least two. Birdie. Oh, yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Chef, as, as you uh -huh. stand with the captain on the ship, uh, she stands. She goes to her favorite spot on Zero the Zero hit points. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's correct. I'm sorry, Neri, the sound, what do you, uh, you, did you, any more to say about your death? <laughs> We've only got five minutes. We gotta keep going. I'm no, so sorry. I'm just dead, and there doesn't feel like there's a reason, and there doesn't feel like there's closure, <laughs> and there doesn't feel like there's meaning. Sometimes people just die. Would you make it to the ripe old age of twenty six? <laughs> oh, that's so middle old. Age. Yeah. Middle yeah. Age. Yeah. <laughs> And uh, on the two scene, old biddies yeah. row away in their boat. <laughs> yeah, we'll come back to you. <laughs> Chef. Okay, sorry. We <laughs> As the ship nearly approaches, the, the slit has widened <laughs> to allow a boat to pass through. Mm. It's as if pulling the ship is the red cloud, uh, pulsating now, moving mm. as if 198 people are all in a giant oh, no. red bag. Oh, like wiggling like together. Like that. <laughs> Just like that. I'll work on the description. That was good, perfect. <laughs> and <laughs> you feel a, an intense heat on your face, a, a white blue heat all around you. The tip of the boat as it almost touches that slit. <laughs> Just the tip. Just, Just the tip. The tip. <laughs> Bursts into flame. Uh, as it goes, oh, God, slides in. <laughs> and what was white uh, in it? <laughs> no. I declare, I'm not have nothing to do with this. Yeah. Never again. <laughs> Look. Look. Get the <laughs> Chef. Uh, you yeah. feel like lifted into the whiteness. Uh, uh, it's just like a blink, nothingness. Mm -hmm. You feel lifted. You, you're not standing on a boat anymore. You're floating. Mm -hmm. And when you look around, it's nothing but just a white void all around you. And you see the crab man walk up, oh. <laughs> wearing his raincoat again. No. <laughs> Joseph. <laughs> Uh, he walks up slowly, gently, and takes your hand and holds it. <laughs> and then his giant crab mouth enlarges and bites down on your head. Uh, and uh, you feel nothing. There is nothing. Oh. 
Could I enter him whole? Uh, oh, oh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, all the crabs. The crabs and the writhing uh, snakes and eels all surround your whole body. And I, I, in the moments before nothingness, it feels kind of nice. <laughs> Back on the rowboat. <laughs> I don't like boats Not or like ghosts. I don't think I want to do that anymore. <laughs> you see the boat uh, immolate. All go up into flame at once. You feel a burst of heat on your face, but you're not close enough uh, for it to really catch you. But then you see sort of like um, with those sparks that fly up from a fire, like they're blue. And some of them go shooting out like shooting stars. Aww. Yeah. Aww. As uh, you see the red go <laughs> in, the red and the blue mix beautifully to make a purple. Oh. And there's a purple cloud. Oh. You see it? Spinning, you stop rowing, just watch oh, its no. beauty. Oh. As the purple oh, no. swirls and swirls. Mm -hmm. And then it's as if it collapses into nothingness. Oh. And you're sitting on a rowboat. I kiss my roommate. <laughs> yeah. And that's the end of our show. Yeah. You did it, you killed us. participatory. It was magical to have each and every one of you here. Um, make this hornier? <laughs> no. I'm a professional. I'm not going to make people uncomfortable in a public setting like that. <laughs> I mean, none of us used our uh, Let's go around the horny horn one more time. And uh, we'll start on this then. Um, just remind everybody, and now that they've fallen madly in love with you, what else <laughs> they can find you at over the weekend. Josephine? Uh, hi, I'm Josephine McCatter. You can find me at JCVIM. Well, I can't even speak anymore. Um, on um, socials and tomorrow in this room at 2 p.m.? I think that's right. Bet. I'm going to be in a Blades in the Dark <gasps> game Ooh. with the Glass Cannon Network. And it would be great if you came. And we're taking audience suggestions as we play. Ooh. Oh. Ooh. So it should be a great time and also be at the booth on Saturday at 11, also playing a game there that is called, that is Scum and Villainy. Yeah. I love Scum and Villainy. It's like Blades in the Dark in Space. Yeah. Ooh. Paula. Mm -hmm. Hi, I'm Paula Deming. Uh, you can find my board game sketch comedy series, Things Get Dicey, on YouTube. This uh, weekend, I will be playing, I will be DMing a D&D 5th edition game at the Glass Cannon Network booth. Um, you can watch that on their Twitch channel. It'll be streamed live. Uh, Silly One Shot made them all play bards. So it's an all bard party. <laughs> uh, oops, all bards. Oops, all bards. And uh, on Saturday, I will be playing in another Call of Cthulhu game, again with Glass Cannon Network uh, at their booth, which again, if you need a break from the crowds and you want to pull up Twitch and watch that, you can watch it live on Twitch there. Yeah. Yay, hey. Abria. Hi, I'm Abria. Hi, Angar. You can follow me on, uh, at Quiddy uh, everywhere. And on Saturday at noon in Room I don't remember. Ballroom 500. <laughs> Thank you. Perfect. I rely on the kindness of strangers. And yeah, also Becca. <laughs> uh, we will be doing Misfits and Magic, a bad kids uh, one shot. <sighs> I will be doing a creepy French accent in that one. <laughs> it's going to be so professional. <laughs> if you know what. Yeah. <laughs> so this is just that. Sage! Hi, uh, I'm Sage Ryan. I go by Not Sage everywhere on the internet or Pixel Circus, where you can find me playing D&D with Abria typically every Friday night. Uh, but for this weekend, you can find me tomorrow at the Foreteller booth at 11 a.m. for a little signing and meet and greet. And then at a mm, couple hours later for the Dark Horse uh, <laughs> panel on TTRPGs, kickstarting, and uh, raising money for making your projects. Hell Ooh. yeah! Uh, and I am Becca Scott. Yeah, I have you been are. your humble keeper of arcane lore. Yeah. Um, <laughs> 
we have stuff. I have a lot of things to say. I have a lot of things to say. Thank you. I love you. Um, genuinely, it means so much that you were all here and that we sold out this room because um, this was the first original thing I've written. And so it was amazing. Wait, shut up. What? Yeah. Oh my God. Yeah. It was so good. Are trying to fuck. Uh, <laughs> yeah, sure. yeah, um, hope kids aren't watching this. Sorry, people on Twitch. Um, <laughs> you already knew this was not for kids. Um, <laughs> uh, Want to thank our sponsor one more time, Chaosium. Yes. Uh, I just have felt so supported and have worked with them for a while, and they're just wonderful folks, and I really like their products. Um, fuck Lovecraft, and we love people at Chaosium. Those are a separate things. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> um, and. Uh, my inspiration was using these fabulous Malleus Monstrarums. There is one about deities and one about monsters, and that's where I uh, took my inspo from. That's so cool. if, if you are a keeper or want to become one, highly recommend. Also, please enjoy the board game that they gave to everyone in the room, which is super sweet. Um, and that's it. We'll, we'll see you around. Bye. Bye. Bye.